Hey, check out this cool experiment. We're gonna put some Avion water into this beaker and some Aquafina water into the other beaker. Now I'm gonna take this bar of ivory soap and shave some pieces of it into each beaker. First the Avion and then the Aquafina. All right, time for the experiment. Watch what happens when I blow through this straw into the soapy Avion water. Well, except for the water getting cloudy, I don't notice a whole lot going on here. All right, now let's try the Aquafina. Whoa, look at all those bubbles. What the heck is going on here? Well, you see, ivory soap contains a compound called sodium palmitate, which dissolves in water. And when there are dissolved palmitate ions in water, it bubbles more easily. But Avion water contains calcium ions, which react with these palmitate ions found in soap to form solid calcium palmitate, like this. Watch what happens when I add shavings of ivory soap to Avion water and also to Aquafina water, which essentially has all ions removed. We clearly see the formation of solid calcium palmitate in the Avion water, but in the purified Aquafina, no solid formation is seen. And while the formation of the solid calcium palmitate really is kind of beautiful to watch, this process removes the palmitate ion from solution. But remember that dissolved palmitate ion helps bubble formation. Hey, so now we can understand the results. Blowing into the soapy Avion water produces no bubbles because there's no dissolved palmitate. The calcium ions remove them. On the other hand, the palmitate ions remain dissolved in the purified Aquafina water. So in this beaker, we get a bubble party.